Welcome to the official Windows 8 channel and today we're going to show you how to change your default music app in Windows 8.1. By default, if you have music, you listen to music, what's going to happen is that the music that you want to listen to will open with the music app that's available with Windows 8. Now, it's not that it's a bad app, it's actually quite nice, very nicely organized, and maybe you like it and that's fine, but it brings you also to the Xbox Music um, so that you can buy uh, music online and stuff like that. Now, maybe you don't like that app and you have your own app. Maybe if you're using, for example, an iPod or you're using your iPhone as a music device, you know that you have to go through iTunes to synchronize your own um, music library that you have in your computer. So, having the default app being the music app of Windows is not a good idea. You don't want to listen necessarily to the music you have or the audio files with that device. So, how do you change that? You just go into your charms bar on the right side of the screen by swiping or going to the corners and uh, in the search instead of everywhere click settings and type default first thing is gonna happen is at the top you'll have default app settings just click there and you'll see music player what the default app is now here it says it's music but if you click on it you'll see a list of all the apps that you have on your computer that can play music and you'll just have to change the default app for example I prefer VLC that's the media player that I use to listen to music and that I enjoy listening to music all you have to do is just click your favorite app and as soon as you did that every app that you're going every uh, music file or audio file that you have on your computer that you want to listen to are going to be played through your favorite app. That's all you have to do. You can now listen to your music through your favorite app. Um, I don't know if I have music here. We'll just check music. Um, yeah, your Rhythmix here. So, for example, now they all have that little um, cone. So if I click, it opens this app like I want it. And now that I can ooh, stop it, here we go. And so now VLC is my media player. So you just choose whatever uh, app that you want and it's going to play. You notice that on the top right there was a little a bubble that appeared that says, well, you have different apps that can play this type of uh, file. So you can also click that. It's basically going to bring you to the list of all the different apps you have. But uh, that's how you actually put your favorite music app. Um, we don't all like the Windows 8 music uh, app, even though it's nice and it's really nicely organized. Um, I prefer using VLC. Some others, like I said, with an iPod, you might want to use iTunes. Uh, or maybe you just want to use Media Player because you've been using it for so long and you're used to it. Just put Media Player, just choose Media Player in the list, and that's the app that's going to play all the audio and music files. If you enjoy our videos, please subscribe to our channel and you'll be informed when new videos are online. If you have any comments, questions on what you've seen, let us know. Maybe you have a feature of Windows 8 that you'd like us to talk about. Uh, let us know. We'll try to put that video online. And um, maybe you have that new Windows 8 machine or planning to buy one. You're not, not really sure on how to use it. Uh, browse our videos and you will... Uh, slowly learn how to use Windows 8 to the max. Thanks for watching and hope that you come back to the official Windows 8 channel. Bye-bye.